Warren D. Martini has one of the most unique guitars around. It's a Charvel uh, guitar called the Python because he found a python snake skin in New Orleans and had it affixed to the front and the back of this guitar, so the entire guitar, that's how big that python is, you know, that's, that's a wide piece of snake skin uh, that you've got to wrap around, uh, you know, do the front and the back of the guitar with and the sides. Uh, and it's well worn and you can see how from his playing it because it's uh, it's snakeskin it's kind of like leather and you can see like the scales of the of the of the snakeskin are, are weathered and softer from his playing but still there because snakeskin is so tough and so it wears very well as, as a guitar there's some holes worn through it a little bit that add a lot of character to the guitar and how much he played and you know I, I grew up listening to Rat I mean then that's the guitar he's he was he was rocking on and uh, uh, now he's got a signature Python guitar out by Charvel which is a very cool looking guitar uh, and his original is just awesome uh, so we got that guitar and uh, that was photographed at his house I went over there and he had this beautiful purple uh, velvet chair and so we put the the python guitar in the chair and i just love those pictures warren also had this uh beautiful vintage 1958 fender strat that he purchased uh in 1980 in the 80s for two thousand dollars and today that guitar is worth fifteen to twenty thousand dollars so it's nice to see some artists have these great collections that they bought in, in the early days and then they es they escalated in value uh he has another really cool charvel that um, has some french text on it uh, translates this too fast to live too young to die that guitar was featured on the cover of his Infestation album. This is a really cool, iconic guitar that he has. It's a custom signature guitar of his. The other guitar of his that I have is the 1985 Charvel Crossed Swords guitar. And the artwork was inspired by a Gary Moore album cover, where Gary Moore is standing there with a, some kind of a flight jacket on. And uh, it has some Japanese writing on it. And so they incorporated that into this guitar Warren didn't know what it meant until one time he was in Japan and a Japanese guy read it for him and said, oh, that says London on there. And uh, so that was cool. And apparently he was in London at the time when he found that out. So uh, it's, it's a very cool, he's got a very cool and unique collection of guitars. And uh, growing up with Rat, uh, it was just awesome to be able to spend some quiet time with, with uh, Warren at his home and photograph his guitars.